In October of 2018, I returned to Guadalupe Island. This time on the Nautilus Explorer. The mission? Simple. Document the unprecedented level of white shark activity. Social media was ablaze with people saying there were so many sharks that they didn't know where to look. Over 40 in one trip and 12 on one dive alone. In 2017, just 50 weeks prior, we saw six sharks total and thought it was a fantastic experience. So I was really curious to see what this year was going to be like. Day one of diving delivered. We saw eight sharks total. The action does lessen later into the fall once the more dominant sharks show up. But even still, at one point, the action was so non-stop that I recorded for 20 minutes straight when I normally record for 20 seconds max. Every time I went to stop recording, another shark showed up, the shark that we thought had left was back. It was just a fantastic day of diving. As we ascended from that one epic dive, I remember this distinct feeling that something very special was happening. But the question remained. Why are there so many sharks here, like never before? Day one was incredible. Early on day two, I looked to the depths and I saw a very large shark with a deformed tail rising to the surface. Lucy was here. 17 feet of white shark greatness. Some say that we shouldn't be here, that we shouldn't be feeding these animals, that they have to use too much energy to capture the bait. I'm no scientist, but I disagree. I have noticed some unique behaviors though. The first is that they don't roll their eyes back to protect them as they normally do when making a strike. We saw this over and over and over again. The second is that these animals are coming in extreme close proximity to one another with zero regression. At one point, I was filming Lucy. And unknown to me, Ropey was coming from behind me and the two almost crashed into each other. At one point I wondered, 
are they cooperating? Are they collaborating? Is this show of force, the sheer numbers that we're seeing, is it a collaboration among sharks to send a message to humanity? For the first time in the history of the planet, one species has the ability to prevent its own extinction. and that of all other species. A new war is upon us that requires a different type of soldier brandishing a different type of weapon. This is the age of the filmmaker. <laughs>